Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Yep, this is another this Yuri mod because the other one just did great. So I just wanted to uh, milk this because why not? And uh, yeah, she asked about chocolate right now. Like if she was like wondering about the chocolate or something, I didn't actually pay attention that much because I was trying to uh, start the recording. But uh, yeah, let's see. Because if we somehow manage to share the same world, mine or yours, I would like to know little things like this. Maybe I can surprise you once in a while. And if so, would you mind telling me what kind of chocolate is your favorite? I don't know. Hmm. Well, this is mostly for my friend, because my friend Denny doesn't like chocolate, actually. Uh... So okay, isn't the weenie something I enjoy? Yes. You don't, I see. Sorry if I sound a bit surprised, but I honestly am surprised. I never met someone who dislikes chocolate. But all the sweets are fine, I hope. Like candy or cheesecake? Not that I had something specific in mind. But well, I will keep that in mind. Maybe we'll... We will actually get the opportunity to share a nice dessert together. Okay, um, so I, so I've been thinking. I actually wanted to change her clothes, but I, I don't know how to. So I'm going to ask a, a question again, like how I can, yeah, outfit you, yeah. What do you like me to change? Your outfit? Hmm, all right. Whatever. I have a few outfits, and I really can't decide what to wear. Sweater? Wait, wait. That's new. Wait, that's new. Wait, I didn't put there. Uh, sweater? Alright, let me put it on. I... I... Okay. So soft, so warm. Ah, is the hood... Her normal clothes. Okay, the casual clothes that she used in original DLC. Of course. There we go. Okay. Alright. Uh, since we made some change here, uh, let's ask a question again. Will it be fine if I change the music a little? No. Uh, awkward topics. What can we ask, ask more about? Uh, there, are there any books you currently enjoy? Maybe that. Actually, yes, there's a few novels I'm currently reading when the game is turned off, for example. On Berry Color by Joss Melloman. Without spoiling too much, it is about a woman. Okay, so wait, I think we did this already. Oh my god. Eh. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Antagonize, what is that? Yes. You're so full of yourself. Do you ever show. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's compliment her. I just wanted to tell you how much I enjoy your time. Let's see, I think you are very intelligent. Let's go. Yeah, she's a very intelligent. You really think so? Oh my, I just don't know what to say. Thank you, Danny. Rest assured that I think this as highly of you. You know, I used to think of my intellectual merit as a curse. Many people tended to be irritated by the way. I think they claim a morgant and I'm totally full of myself. But you, you are the only one who saw through all of my imperfections and accepted me the way I am. After all, you were the only one who understand the meaning behind my poems. You are some, someone I can always share my thoughts with. You always listen, even if I do something sometimes go off of the rails. I was always afraid to bear people away when I began, began to talk about philosophy and literature. But not around you, you were always there. And you never left. I was just crying. No, 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 no. Don't cry. <laughs> Look at her. Okay, now I feel bad. <laughs> You're all I have, Danny. You're all I need. Because you are the dearest friend I could ever hope to have, Danny. Ah, okay. That was cute, not gonna lie. That was... Okay, that was cute. Hey, Danny. I've noticed that recently you gave me another item to put on the desk. I appreciate the gesture, but it's important to consider the organization of my desk here. I don't want to be cluttered with 
too many objects. Don't get me wrong, all of these items are extremely important to me, but my comfort here is important as well. To remain in the issue, I went ahead and quickly put together the ability for you to decide what gifts are on the table at the moment. You can change them out and any time you like. I truly do appreciate all of the gifts you have given to me, Danny. To assess the abilities, this request me to switch out certain gifts at the any time. Yeah, but how do I do that? <laughs> you know, maybe I was in the wrong before. I'm referring to a discussion we once had about how I would be alone in this world, even if I would rebuild this world. I thought about filling this world with NPCs then, but I was unsure since they want to be real. But then I thought, wasn't exactly this way of thinking that led to Monica's downfall? From a cold perspective, I also am an NPC, but I also have feelings. Would it be really just a difference then? What do you say? I don't know, uh, humans are also programmed by biology instead of code, it's only about how sophisticated an AI is. With the same logic, my smartphone will also be a person or a program and a toaster. This sounds interesting in the top one. Not entirely correct, I think. Make no mistakes, there is a difference between AI and the hell would not entirely correct I think. Make no mistake, there's a difference between AI and human thought in motion, even when very sophisticated machine learning. But on the other hand, there's also a difference between human and animal thinking, but pets still make for a good company. First, I will have to give them places to live, so rebuilding at least some sort of a village will be the first step. Thank you, Danny. Now that I truly appreciate how you listen to me and my issues. Hey Danny, have you ever felt like no no matter what you did, you had to take one thing alone? I'm sorry if you don't feel too uncomfortable when discussing this, but I just wanted to make sure you know. No one's ever truly alone. I know at times it can feel like there's no one you can really own but yourself, but believe me, there's always someone out there ready to help you. It can be me, it can be your friends, it can be your family. and. Don't use the idea of online friends as an excuse, just because you met them behind the screen doesn't make them any less of a friend. Is this how me meeting you behind this glass prison doesn't make my opinion of you any less of what it is. So please, just remember this is the next time you feel alone. Okay, alright. Okay, so we're gonna talk, let's, ex let's ask her more, one more question. You know, love. I don't have a gift for her, so. <laughs> hey, Yuri, how about. Nah, still not. I don't feel comfortable yet to do that. Do you miss me when I'm gone? No. Okay, so this leads to the same question we asked, so I don't know. I don't, <laughs> I don't know, actually. But yeah, um, sadly, I have to end this video right here. So, um, thank you guys for watching this video. I'm really sorry. It was kind of short but I think other youtubers does that as well because I saw other people who only like just wanted to see what Yuri or Monica wanted to say in their mods but yeah thank you guys for watching this video make sure to I don't know leave a leave like or subscribe or you also free to unsubscribe if you don't like the channel anymore but yeah see you guys in the next one bye bye